hey guys welcome back to coding stuff and in this video we're gonna implement instagram double tap to like feature all right so i have created this project as you can see we don't have anything in the main activity till now but i have prepared the activity main layout which is simple as you can see we just have one image view which uh, height i have set as a 230 dp anyways you'll get the source code in the description box so if you want this layout you can just get it from there then i have another image view which is this heart as you can see to like or dislike and i also have one image view over here in instagram we have this image view when we like uh, when we like uh, any post then this uh, pops up all right so we'll initially we'll make it invisible cool and then i added this drivers from the android itself or uh, it is this one is the red heart then heart with the black border as we have in the instagram then again this white heart and this image view that i have downloaded from the internet cool so first thing that we need to do that enable the view binding to enable the view binding we just need to write build features then view binding true and then click on sync now I guess you can do that so I'll close this and yeah now what we'll do I'll prepare some animations so to prepare the animations I'll click on the resource android resource file I'll select the animation over here then I'll name it as kind of zoom in and we'll use scale animation over here so over here I'll write scale which will have duration of android duration I'll set it to 200 milliseconds cool then from x x scale 1 and I'll duplicate this from y scale 1 as well I'll set the pivot so pivot x will be 50 percent and pivot y will be 50 percent as well so pivot y and then we just need to set two properties to x scale and to y scale so I'll use 1.3 value here again you can play with this value whatever the animation you like totally depends on you so it's all about customization i'll just copy this and i'll create another animation file so animation resource file i'll name it as zoom out i'll paste the code that i have copied from the zoom in and here i'll just increase the duration to 300 300 and from 1.3 0.3 to 0.5 0.5 again you can just play with this uh, values it's totally up to you all right so zoom in and zoom out is done i'll just close this and i'll close this as well so now we need to implement the main activity first of all i'll create what late init var so private late init var binding activity main binding will initialize the binding over here so binding equals to activity main binding dot inflate we need to pass the layout inflator and instead of passing the layout resource file will pass binding dot root cool so we'll apply on click listener on this uh, image view and on this image view as well but on this post image we'll apply double click listener and here single click listener so we don't have double click listener in android so we need to create our custom click listener so for that i will prepare one abstract class so over here what we will do we will create an abstract class so abstract class and i will name it as a double click listener and this class will inherit from view dot on click listener and here first of all i will create one var which will be last click time we'll play with the time only here so last click time this will be up to long and i'll set it to zero initially cool then we'll create one companion object to create uh, one constant or create a delta time so i'll just name it as okay let's just private const val and i'll name it as a double click Okay. Mm -hmm. 
time delta and I'll set it to 300 milliseconds cool then you can use this I'll just go down over here and will override on click click on click function which you get from this on click listener so on click cool this one and instead of p0 we'll name it as a v as it is more readable all right so here again we just need to play with the click uh, the click times so click time we'll create one val for click time and this will be equals to system dot current time in millis then we just have to uh, play one condition here so if click time minus last click time is less than the delta that we set which is double click time delta so if this is the case then we'll call one function which will be on double click and here we'll pass the v view itself and we'll create that function over here which will be abstract as will not provide the implementation over here so abstract one on double click this will take v of type view which is nullable cool and here we'll just set this last call click time to click time cool and this will be happy so all right this is done now we'll jump to the on create and we'll implement the double tap functionality so binding dot measure dot set on click listener and here, here we need to pass object of type double click listener and it will give us error to implement the function so we'll implement the member which is on double click this one cool so i'll delete this to do and if you go to this image view you can see this is the post image view all right so before implementing this function we'll create the animations so well uh, zoom in anim this will come from animation utils dot load animations we need to pass the context and the resource so r dot anim anim dot zoom in i'll duplicate this and this will be zoom out and we just need to rename this to zoom out anim cool so here we can again i'll prepare one um, boolean okay we can do that later so in here what we need to do we just need to change the heart image to the initially we'll have this border heart image but we want to change it to fully red heart so binding dot heart set image resource r dot drawable dot baseline favorite 24 which is heart image yeah and then we'll start the animation so binding dot heart start animation zoom in anim and i'll duplicate this two times and i'll also anim the also animate to this image view which is invisible white heart so its id is i guess inside hard i guess i have misspelled there but it's fine so inside hard and i'll duplicate this but this time it will be zoom out zoom out anim all right so if we double tap on it or uh, the image this will be triggered and all the resource will be set up but in the instagram we can also uh, dislike the post with when we click on this heart so we need to implement that functionality in instagram we we cannot dislike the button uh, we cannot dislike the post when we double tap double tap on it we can only like it but with this button we can dislike it as well so we also need to implement the double or dislike functionality there so we we'll just add on click listener on the heart so set on click listener this time it will be simple on click listener and we'll prepare one boolean over here so private var is liked and initially it will be false so false and we'll make it true when we double tap it so is liked this will be equals to true and over here we just need to check if is liked is true if it is true uh, we will dislike it if it is false we will like it so in here we can just copy this we just need to change the resource file of the heart to border one so baseline favorite border 24 this one cool and then again i'll just paste this and we need to make it baseline 24 all right and i'll copy this animations from here and i'll paste it over here and 
finally we okay okay we can just cut this we also want to animate the heart when we like the post or dislike the post so i'll keep it out of this if else condition and lastly what we need to do we need to change the value of is liked so i'll just reverse it so if it was false it will be true if it is true it will be false so i hope everything is done now we'll run the app and we'll see it's working or not so i have connected my device as well so our app has been installed as you can see and now uh, first we'll check this functionality so i'll click on this and yeah this one is working so like and dislike functionality is working when we single click on this heart but now we'll check with the double tap feature and yeah this one is also working and instagram as well you can't you can't dislike the post on double tap you can only like it cool so if i click on this this will be disliked yeah so yeah that's it for this video and i will provide source code in the description box so if you get some issues uh, you can check with that but this was a simple video i guess so yeah that's it do subscribe and thank you for watching